Uh, hello guys to uh, another video on my channel. And, uh, I know it's been like about a month or so since my, my last video. But hey, now I'm making another one. Now, you know, uh, as of the recording of uh, this video, which is about 11-12, it's uh, Saturday when I release it more, it'll be Monday. Now, if you're asking... When, now, if you're asking yourself why this is relevant, that's because, well, yesterday on Friday is when uh, I had my last day of school, so, <laughs> yeah, summer's out, bitches, or school's out, bitches, you get the point, I have, now it's summer, now I have a lot of time to make videos, not that I didn't before, but now, uh, this summer, I'm going to try to more consistently make videos, and buy more consistently once a week. Maybe, but, but yeah, so, t so today, uh, specifically the video I am making is I'm going to be playing Borderlands free, free, and specifically this, it's specifically going to be a gaming daily video now, if you don't know, gaming daily is a series I do on this channel where I just, where I just play games, just do random shit, just do shit I want. Well, uh, it's like basically just random gaming shit. But yeah, specifically what I'm going to be doing in Borderlands 3 today is I'm going to be loot farming. I'm trying, yeah, right now I'm trying to get this revolver, this Jacobs revolver, which Jacobs is one, one of the manufacturers of weapons from Borderlands 3. 3? And yes, it has the same name as me, but anyways, it's a Jacobs revolver called a wagon wheel that I saw on the internet. The way you get it is you farm this boss... On Skywell, Skywell, which is like a location in uh, Promethea that you that you go to pretty early on in the game, like around like level 10, 11. Like what well, well, around when you reach, when you normally reach that level, it's like when you go to Promethea, and, and you don't go to Skywell like right away. That's like kind of near like the the end of the Prome Promethea story, like the end of end of what would be. From the whole Promethea part of the game, but yeah, wagon wheel. I'm just trying to get it. I've been trying to get it. Like I farmed this thing like a couple dozen of times, and I still have not gotten it. Got some pretty good weapons though. Like this busher shotgun, which I'll show you, is fucking insane. It's like overpowered as all hell. This just don't stop firing. Also, I got some more level up versions of the of the uh, of some weapons I had previously because I have fought this thing before with like my brother. Because yeah, my, me and my brother we've been playing Borderlands Three together, and we fought this guy before to get this weapon called the Lucian's Call, which is like basically a minigun thing. And we got it on our first try, luckily, and uh, I got a cor a coercive version of Lucian's Call. It can be... You can get other elements for it. Like, it is like a level 22 version. But now I've upgraded my Lucian's Call to like a level 26 version. Which is good. And now, I leveled up to level 27. And shortly after gain leveling up, I got a level 27 Lucian's Call. Specifically a coercive one. But, I'm playing... But, while I was farming, I got like a level 26 Incinerate Lucian's Call, which is a fire version of Lucian's Call, and now I want to get a level 27 version of that, because I don't, I have level 26, I just want to give it a little more levels, doesn't, wouldn't really make a difference other than a few changes in damage and other stats, but I've talked long enough, it's time to go into my brother's room where he has the whole Xbox thing, so I'm just going to take my food, some strawberries and the steak my dad made, just going to park it right, Right here. Um. Oh yeah, you don't notice. But yeah, also my brother's TV looks a lot less ass than my TV. So you might get some better visuals. I like the Sonic videos. Where I have to fucking mess around the TV color stains just to make it fucking watchable. Actually, guys, uh, I'm going to pause the video here and I'm going to go set the TV up. Like moving around physically so I can get a better view of it. 
of it, so give me a second. And I'm back. So now I move the TV more to the left towards the Xbox. Uh, and, you, and so now I got the thing. I got this thing ready. See, so yeah, the visuals look pretty good, don't they? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's because my brother's TV that he has is a lot, lot less ass than the TV we have like, in the living room. Yeah, this is my brother's profile pic. It's like a cat boy thing. Yeah, it's my brother likes anime, and recently, yeah, he's actually, he was on a Naruto marathon. He finished Naruto, now watching Boruto, Boruto, however the fuck you say it. My brother says, says I say it wrong, but whatever. In fact, he was watching the show, the show, and he said he was watching it on my phone's hotspot, not this phone. This I have, like, two phones. I have one without data and one with data, which actually my brother had right here. Here, here, like this is one with the hotspot. I have it off right now to, to save the hotspot. But yeah, Chase brother was using it to, to watch the show, and he had it right, and I had it right there, so we can get a better signal. Well, yeah, that's because like the Wi-Fi is out. My mom like is like getting satellite in there yet, yeah, which doesn't really work for the game, but hey, at least it'll give us internet again. But yeah, so now I just gotta go to my profile. Shit, uh, forgot something. Give me a sec. Gotta get the remote for his TV so I can actually turn up the volume. He, yeah, my brother usually has the headphones in when he's using the TV, so he just has the internet. Just no, he doesn't have the volume always off because he's off using his headphones. Headphones. Yeah. Okay. So let's uh. Sorry, I should probably pause the stuff like this, but whatever. Yeah, Nero. It's not really my profile, but it's just a profile I use for Borderlands. He also has an uh, anime girl for this one. Not also, the other one is a cowboy, so he just has an anime girl for this one. <coughs> yeah. With this. <coughs> Yeah. With this, with, with the core quality of this phone, you still can't see images super clear, but it's at least a lot better than the TV. Oh, shit. I just remember something. Yeah, this game, like, takes for fucking forever to load. Like, it does. It takes, like, fucking minutes to load, man. It's, this thing's slow. <coughs> I think we're just gonna go turn close the door. Like in the meantime. Gearbox. Yeah, this game's awesome. I'll even show off some of my weapons once we actually get into the game. Which will take like several minutes. And while you wait, hey, you fucking see Claptrap dance. Yeah. It might be better than like the other TV, but. Gosh, seeing how what the actual TV looks like and seeing it from my phone, God, it looks bad. Maybe turn on the brightness, make it better. Yeah, no, too much brightness. It seems like turning on the brightness just lets you actually see it. it doesn't look, it doesn't look, make it look, clap it looks like a fucking, fucking beacon of yellow light. You still can't see the picture clearly because. Let's see if I can go in close to that. Like, yeah, apparently. No, not even going to be close as you see it. I'm just trying to experiment here to see. Yeah, you would have to be super close. Fucking hang out. My camera works. Whatever. Uh, like I said, it takes a while. It's been like two minutes already, and we're not anywhere close. Like I said, this is going to take a while. So yeah, so what I've been—that's my dog coming from downstairs. Is 
I think Shadow, but you see, yeah, what I've been doing for like the past, for the past day and like on Friday, man, it's just like reading and, uh, and, uh, watching YouTube about it. But yeah, this summer I plan to like, uh, maybe get my driver's license, license, uh, do more consistent uploads. Oh, and uh, just do more reading. So, like, I have a ton of books, like both physical book and like Kindle books that I haven't read yet. Hell, I even have a ton of fucking fan fiction stories I want to read that look fucking cool. Like this one, Overlord, Re Zero crossover. It's called He Like Who Is Beyond Sin, something like that, which is freaking pretty cool. Like, now that, yeah, now I think about it, yeah, it's not like the best. I think I don't remember. I don't remember. Jeez. My thoughts are just scattered. I don't know how to get words properly out, but it's pretty good. But yeah, my phone has been, like, held by, like, the high school for, like, a long time because I, like, got caught using it. And I only just got it back yesterday. So there's, like, some stories on that in my Google tabs that I want to read. Like, some worm fan fiction. And if you don't know what Worm is, I could go into a long explanation, but honestly, I'm inadequate for that, because I'm bad at explanation, so if you want to see what Worm is, just look up on Google, like, just go to fucking Google search, and then look up Worm Superhero Series, or just Worm Superhero, or Parahuman, or, para, or Parahuman Wildbow, or, I don't know, just like a worm book, even. That actually might just give you a book about worms, but... But yeah, it's it's a superhero series. It's, it's I've never read it. I've just read fan fictions of it. But yeah, it's like a dark superhero ser series. Like, the main character fucking dies at the end, I'm pretty sure. Although, from what I've seen, there are some... Stuff to suggest she doesn't die, but just gets transported to an alternate Earth. Maybe I, I don't know. I like I said, I haven't even looked the wiki of it. I even bar looking wiki. I just play. I just read fan fiction. So if anyone uh, is that who knows Worm is hell, even Red Worm, just post in the comments if I'm wrong about the fucking about the ending Worm. I don't. Know. I like the ideas of Worm, the character of Worm, but. Yeah, personally, I just want dark stuff. But anyways, it's loaded now. So this is my uh, character, Mozzie. And she, yeah, and she's like a mech soldier, soldier. And in the game, you can summon like this big ass mech, mech. And there's like multiple weapons you can equip to it. Like you can like, equip the mini gun. Like out of the gate, the, the initial three weapons you can equip on your mech is either a mini like like. A minigun, a grenade launcher, or like this big ass regular that shoots like a big blue beam. Now you can actually equip two weapons at once. So you can have like a minigun and a grenade launcher, or like you just have two grenade launchers, two gren two two miniguns. But later on, as you go down the skill tree, you can get like additional weapons. Like if you go down the grenade launcher skill tree, you can get like rocket pods, or you can just get upgrades to the rocket to the uh. To grenade launcher itself. That's how it works for our weapons. Like, like the minigun, you can either, when you go down a tree, you can either upgrade the minigun itself, or you just get a different weapon, which is like, I think, like Salamander, which is like a flamethrower. And for the railgun, you can either upgrade it to get like this super, like, to get this, to get like the super beam that's like a red beam instead of a blue beam. And the blue beam, actually, the railgun deals shock damage, but the blue beam does incendiary damage. But the other weapon you, you can get, instead of just an upgraded version of the normal weapon, is just like a big melee attack, like a bear fist. Yeah. I like this character. I, I like mechs in general. I like mecha. It's like a fucking cool-ass concept. But, yeah. Let me just show you some of the characters in-game. Yeah, this is the character description. So yeah, that's like my, my mech, like right, that's the mech right there. 
If you can see all like right there and there, that's the weapons I have equipped. I have a mini gun and a and a rail gu gun. And for the mini gun, I have it upgraded so like a it overheats less. And I have the rail gun upgraded so it does it does the the big red beam does incendiary damage. Damage. So yeah, let's just uh, continue. And I'll show you some of my weapons. Oh yeah, this takes a while too. So yeah, this is a uh, sanctuary free. The uh, the uh, flying home of the Crimson Raiders. It's a spaceship in space. And Mark Mark is there, so when you get your weapons and ammunition. And Moxie there, well, she's like the person who, like runs the bar on the ship. Ship ship and is like one of the, is like a yeah. Let's just say this the character is one that doesn't hide her cleavage. Like a kind of fan service character. Although not kind of really. I also don't have like, enough. I don't know the character enough to really say it, but whatever. One of the, Yeah, I, I. Yeah, I should talk. It's also like a little scripted here. Scripted things, but it's like most games like this. Yep, I'm just gonna wait for this second to load. <sighs> Jeez, 60 minutes and I'm not even in the game. Christ, I should. Next time I make one of the another gaming video, I'm just gonna fucking wait till I get the game set up, and then I'll start the video. Because honestly, you guys must get fucking bored as hell. Hell, maybe I'll just put that in the description. Description, like just like skip to this timestamp or put a comment in the video. Oh yeah, but we're in the game. So yeah. So this is the ship. And there's a big gas ray field. Yeah, the ship right now is like just parked just outside of Promethea. The plan I mentioned earlier. Uh, here's like a little show off my weapons. And I got some skins for these weapons. These aren't the natural skins you get. So this is the Lucian's Call I mentioned earlier. The minigun weapon I mentioned earlier. This is like a fucking coercive SMG I have. Shoots. <coughs> it shoots really fast, and when it hits a tar hits a target, just let me show you. Actually, yeah, that's not a target. I'll I'll show you on the dummy, but I'm gonna check out the shops because these like reload with new weapons. I usually just check them out and see if they have like new legendaries. So yeah. Also, yeah, this is the so yeah, so let me, yeah this game is a little, yeah, TV is a lot better for showing off games, but yeah, it's, let me show you what I mean. When you fire, like a poison cloud that sticks around, does constant of damage. This took around for <coughs> forever, though. <coughs> yeah, this is by, uh, Kill Tree, that's not what I meant to go to, but, weapons. Yeah, so I have, like, a lot of legendaries. And I have, so let me just show you this Lucian's call here, like go inspect it. So this is the uh, skin you normally have, which kind of sucks ass. It's like it's like wooden. It's like fine, but literally almost anything else just looks way better. Like I have this rainbow thing, which looks cool, but kind of weird. But also than this, which I had for a while, looked looks pretty good. Then I got then there's this which I just got recently. But for now, I'm just using this, this lighting thing, and it does look pretty fucking sick. But yeah, I want to show you the SMG and uh, which one? Yeah, that's not the natural colors for that too. This I'm using the rainbow skin. This is how it normally looks like. But yeah, I'm just using the rainbow skin because that's what I like the best on it. Yeah, because other skins, they look fine. Like, perfectly, like, serviceable. Like, really cool for some of them. But I just prefer the rainbow one. It actually looks rather nice. Some, some other weapons, the rainbow just looks ridiculous, but this actually looks pretty sick. <clears throat> oh, this is a butcher shotgun I mentioned earlier, and then 
let me just show you. This weapon's fucking insane. And I'm running the lightning skin on it. And I'm re And also I have an attachment called Book of the Storm. Which, considering that I have a lightning skin and a Book of Storm, kind of a little bit ironic. Which is kind of the whole pull point of why I had, have it. Oh yeah, it's like, yeah, it's these ciphers. Yeah, I have all these marked as junk. Not because I want to sell them, but I'm just labeling them. Because I want to decide on what on what weapons. I want to decide what weapons I want to use. Like, if I want to use my current, like, like for instance, like this SMG. I'm like, I want to decide if I want, like, this, this SMG on the left or this SMG on the right. Like, I want to compare them later. So I have a mark just... <coughs> As jug, just to compare them later. Yeah, I have a lot of shit I need to go over. Yeah, I'm really indecisive about these things, choosing between stuff. So, 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 someday, so soon, like either like when Chase gets back, because he, dad, and a family friend are out skateboarding. So I'm here away for when. Sometime when they get back, or just tomorrow, to like compare, to go over these weapons with him and decide what to, to what to use, what to keep in storage, or what to fucking just sell. But yeah, let me show you the shotgun, which is why I was meaning to do it, but then I went on a tangent. This thing's fucking overpowered. Like, let me show you the shit. See, like eleven bullets. Yeah, and it's got a pretty decent variety of like eight. You can't really see that well, but yeah, like like eight point five one per second. Let me show you the shit. Let me, let me just sh show you the shit. Yeah, this thing just keeps regenerating ammo. It will not run out. You can I can stay here for a full minute, but it will not run out. And yeah, this thing does some pretty high damage. Like look at these numbers. It's like a fucking automatic shotgun. The best part, you can just shoot back, shoot to get your ammo back. Just going slow, and I'll be ammo back. And this pistol, that was also really good. Yeah, normally, like I should also show you off skins. That's what I've been doing. Now I thought there was light skin for this because well, the rainbow looks fine. Yeah, but it just doesn't look really good on it. And this looks fine, but to me, it's just too planned. And this looks pretty cool, but but I like the lightning the best. It's also especially since I got like a book of this, the book of the storm attachment goes what I just I just use this because I got the book of storm attached on it and like lightning skin book of storm attachment called book of the storm hard pass hard pass up. But yeah, this pistol. Man, has an insane fire rate. It's got better fire rate than any of my current weapons. And uh, again, he has a gold skin for it. Here's purple. Here's the rainbow one. Here's the one I used for a while. And here's the black dragon. Pretty cool, I would say. Pretty decent looking, but I'll be the lightning because it just looks really cool. But yes, let me show you just the fire rate on this thing. It doesn't necessarily do a whole lot of damage, but it goes, man. And you have like a little under barrel thing you can switch to, like some zip rockets. Like, look at this. Phew. Pretty, pretty freaking cool. Yeah, since I showed off my ones, I'll might as well just show you the Lucid's call. I think it's also pretty good. Oh yeah, it, with this weapon, if you hit like the head, if you get a critical, critical, it just dodges a bunch, scatters a bunch of bullets. It also occasionally regenerates some bullets. <coughs> yeah, it's got a pretty insane grenade. It's like look at this. It's, that's not the grenade I want to use. What fuck grenade do I have on? That's not the grenade I'm. 
yeah, you can see that Moxie's bouncing pair. That's the grenade I want to use, alright. That light one. Yeah, that's just fucking triple shit. Fuck shit, 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 shit. Yeah, I killed myself with my grenades one time. And yeah, that's really good for spamming that that grenade. Yeah, I have a bunch of other grenades though. That do like more damage, but like rest late ra radius, less elemental damage for the element they have. So yeah, I, I'm going to need to go with these grenades with my brother because I can't decide which ones to use. Yeah, this shield, this shield, uh, pretty good shield. It's got like fast one hundred, fast one hundred, four hundred fifty five, and I have this like way worse shield that only has fast three hundred seventy one. But the reason I'm keeping it is because it's a legendary shield, and it's, and it's got like a hundred percent resistance shock, like hundred percent resistance. Like I will not. Be affected by shock damage with that shield. That's why I'm keeping it in case I ever need that. And there's also this one pistol, which isn't really helpful or good anymore. It's like a. But I just keep it because it's one I used for a while. It's kind of nostalgic. But for me, it's also like pretty cool. Like <clears throat> a little lightning pistol. No, it's not a lightning pistol. It's a fire pistol that shoots a beam of fire. It fucking melted. Enemies when it was good. As